Hey guys and welcome to an items guide for graphics cards. Now there are multiple ways of getting graphics cards. The first one is to loot them from underground caches which if you'd like to see the caches videos I do have a playlist in the link in the description or up in the icon at the top right to all of the playlists for the cache spawns on each map. Another great location is in PC blocks. I say great, they are just a 1% chance of spawning, so they are ridiculously low. Another two great locations is Shoreline and Interchange. I am going to be showing you a decent route to get graphics cards on Interchange as well as Shoreline. So let's get straight into this. Hey guys, so we're currently inside Ollie. The weather outside is absolutely nasty, but we're currently inside Ollie right now. I'm going to be showing you a route. Don't forget to look up to the top left corner and you'll see the mini map moves when I do. So the first door that you can check out is Texco right here. So this is a pretty decent uh, store. And then what you want to do is run upstairs and check out Tech Light. Now, of course, make sure you check all the shelves, including the bottom shelves. A lot of people don't actually check the bottom shelves, and I'm not going to lie, the amount of Tetrises I found during this route, because they also spawns in this exact same route as before. And if you need to get onto the top shelf, by the way, if you just walk against the, um, the cabinet, you can actually just walk up and pick up the item that way as well. Just a little bonus, make sure you check that store right there, because an LEDX can spawn inside that location. So, once you've checked upstairs, come back downstairs again. Of course, don't forget to check these shelves correctly. A lot of people seem to miss out this side as well. There's stuff to just spawn on top of the washing machine right there. So, what you want to do is follow this way. Head into Rasmussen. Just run around the edge. Stuff does spawn on the shelves inside of here, along here, as well as on top of these little islands right here in the middle. So, don't forget to check these out. Now what you want to do is run past Generic and Kibba and keep heading in this direction. You can see Mantis is coming up on the left hand side. Of course you need to be very careful in case Killer is here because Killer is a big issue. You now want to head into German which is this store on the right hand side. Items do spawn inside here as well as tech items. Don't forget to check the pedestals in the middle and along around the edge as well. The next room you want to be checking out is actually the I remember, uh, the uh, Emicom unit room. So you do need the key for this one. If you would like to see the key, there will be a link up in the iCard or in the link in the description to the video. So when entering this room, if you just head over to this area right here, I've actually got graphics cards from here, but on this shelf right here, these ones here and this one spawns all of the tech items. Of course, this room also spawns LEDXs, so make sure you keep your eye out. Now, heading through, what you want to head into is this door right here, TTS. Pull it around the left hand side and as you can see, a wonderful show, graphics cards spawn on these desks all the way up here and also these shelves right here. If you want to head out of the this area from the back way, you can parkour by doing that one or jump on that shelf that's just behind that blue tarp. The final location is in the idea offices. Bear in mind, this is a very high traffic area, all of these stores that you, I just went to, so just be careful. And of course, because we are going all the way to idea, this route is also reserve, um, reversible. Which meaning, of course, you can check from this one and then make your way in that direction. Of course, there's a higher chance you're going to get graphics cards in the, you know, the two tech stores at the very start of this route. But if you didn't spawn that side, you might as well just reverse it and might get lucky. So these shelves right here spawn graphics cards as well as at the back right here where that little G phone is. And in the back right here also has a chance of spawning them as well. So let's head over to Shoreline and go check that one out. Okay, so we're now currently on Shoreline. These rooms, okay, so most of the rooms are locked. We are going to start on the west hand side. So entering the west hand side, we do need to go up to the second floor. 
Once on the second floor, you need to head into room 216. And I'll show you whereabouts. So you jump over the barbed wire. And then 216 right here. You do need the key for this. All of the keys will be linked in the description if you need help finding them. And the items do spawn on top of that little box right there that says Terror Group. The next location we're going to be hitting up is 301. This is currently west, so it's a west room 301. So turning around this corner right here, unlocking this door. Follow it through to the next room and they can spawn on top of this table right here. As well as on these two water barrels and on the floor right there. Okay, so now we're going to go and head into admin. Admin is the cinema at the very top of the map, just over here to the left hand side. Drop down. Okay. So, entering the room, what you need to do, or entering the building, head up the stairs and go left. Once you've gone left, don't forget to check all of these PCs right here. Pretty high chance you can find them inside there. And then inside this room, right here, has a chance of spawning right here and on the desk. And as well as right here on these shelves. Now we're going to go head into east side. The first room that we're going to be checking out is east 222 and 226. This is a very highly trafficked area, mainly due to the LEDX spawns that are on shoreline. So you're most probably going to be checking these rooms anyway. But all the way down to the end, if you don't know by the way, the red key card can spawn inside this room right here. Which is a free check because you don't need a key. So 222 and 226, I have the key for 226. Entering the room, I follow it around to the left hand side. And on top of these, you know, tables right here spawn a graphics card as well as some awesome items as well like all these all of these locations that i'm showing you has a chance of spawning tetrises as well and of course the storeroom key right here and 328 can also have a chance if you go in in here head through and they have a chance of spawning right here on top of the table these are all the locations well okay you can also get it in the Radar tower over there. Um, it has a chance of spawning on the second floor. But it's I've never found one at that location before. But I do find them quite regularly in 226 and 222 as well as 328 upstairs. So guys, hopefully you found this guide useful. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I do stream over on twitch.tv slash piranha underscore seven days a week starting at 8am GMT. We've also got a website where you can see every single key extract, basically a huge hub of resource information in the top link on the description as well. Guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.